How often do we ponder the importance of spiritual values in our lives? Today we delve into the profound verse of Matthew 6.33 and uncover its relevance. This verse, found in the New Testament of the Bible, holds a powerful message. It reads, Seek first the kingdom of God and His righteousness, and all these things shall be added to you. What does this mean? Simply put, it emphasizes the need to prioritize spiritual and moral values above our material and worldly concerns. It beckons us to align our priorities with eternal and virtuous principles. The verse also promises us that if we place our trust in God's provision and prioritize our relationship with Him, He will take care of our needs. This verse is not just about faith. It's about living a life that aligns with virtuous principles, trusting in divine provision, and maintaining a balanced perspective. As we delve deeper into this verse, we'll understand how it guides us to prioritize spiritual values and trust in divine provision. Now, let's dissect this verse and its key components. This verse places a significant emphasis on the priority of values. It encourages us to place spiritual and moral values above the material and worldly. By seeking the kingdom of God and His righteousness first, we're guided to align our priorities with eternal and virtuous principles. Next we see the trust in divine provision. The promise that all these things shall be added to you suggests a reliance on God's care. It's a gentle reminder that when we put our relationship with Him first, He takes care of our needs. Then, we encounter the notion of balancing ambitions. While it's not wrong to chase our goals, this verse inspires us to keep a level-headed perspective. Seeking God's kingdom first means our pursuits should align with His will and contribute to the greater good. The verse also highlights contentment in God's will. This involves aligning our desires with His and finding satisfaction in His plan for our lives. It's a lesson in embracing God's will with gratitude, knowing that His plan is ultimately for our benefit. Freedom from anxiety is also a key component. The preceding verses in Matthew 6 discuss the futility of worrying about material needs. By putting God's kingdom first, we learn to let go of anxiety about worldly concerns, finding peace in the assurance that God is in control. The verse encourages a long-term perspective on life. Rather than focusing solely on immediate gratification or short-term gains, we're encouraged to invest in the eternal and enduring aspects of life. By seeking God's kingdom and righteousness, we're guided towards a holistic well-being that encompasses spiritual, moral, and emotional dimensions. It tells us that true fulfillment comes from aligning all aspects of life with God's principles. Lastly, the verse talks about purposeful living. Seeking the kingdom of God gives life a greater sense of purpose. It directs us to live with a higher calling and to contribute positively to the well-being of others and the world around us. These components collectively teach us to align our lives with spiritual values, trust in God's plan, and live a purpose-driven life. Having explored the depth of Matthew 6.33, we now summarize its key teachings. This verse imparts vital life lessons about prioritizing spiritual values, showing us the importance of aligning our lives with eternal and virtuous principles. It emphasizes trust in God's provision, reminding us that as we prioritize our relationship with Him, He promises to take care of our needs. Balancing ambitions is another key point, encouraging a perspective where our pursuits align with His will and contribute to the greater good. The verse teaches us about finding contentment in God's will, releasing anxiety, and adopting a long-term perspective on life. It guides us towards a holistic well-being, emphasizing that true fulfillment comes from aligning all aspects of life with God's principles. Lastly, it leads us to live purposefully, adding a greater sense of purpose to our lives. Indeed, applying these lessons from Matthew 6.33 can lead to a more fulfilling and meaningful life grounded in a relationship with God. Remember, seek first the kingdom of God and His righteousness, and all these things shall be added to you.